coach kind of the tournament of uh, the low seed always coming in. I mean, I know you joked around a little bit ago about wanting to be on the, uh, the low seeded bench, but talk about that run for your team. The first two games, you start down 0 2, and so you're already fighting elimination in every set after both of them. To be able to come back, to persevere, never say die, and then today come on and actually start with the lead and then and then finish it off for a victory. Yeah. Uh, you know, volleyball is such a, a mental and a, a momentum sport, and, and so we talked about uh, the past uh, week here that, hey, you're the sixth seed. Uh, you know, we snuck in. I've uh, got nothing to lose, and, and so we played a little tight in the first couple sets and said, hey, let's relax. Uh, go out there and see if we can uh, you know, pass the ball a little better, hit the ball inside 900 square feet, and make our blocking a little quicker. Uh, you know, we gained a little momentum, and it just snowballed and rolled, and uh, you know, I was a little nervous when we won the first two sets today uh, because that's been the opposite that side of the coin for us. What, what did you say or anything to your ladies when you won the first two sets and then they came back and won that third set to, to get out of their mind because, hey, you've already done it twice, now they're going to do it. What did you say, if anything, to get that away? Uh, we just said, hey, uh, we're doing some good stuff. We try to keep them relaxed, uh, you know, go out, pass the ball, uh, set, cover, transition back to base, um, set the block up, seal, just all fundamental stuff. And, you know, we just let them, we didn't really do anything. It was as the girls played well on the court today and uh, let them take care of business. So talk about your ladies. Uh, a very great team effort, but some very strong individual performances at times. Par mentor, when you needed her on, she was on. Ruffer came in, and, and really a jack of all trades, triple double yesterday, really close today. Just talk about them being able to do everything. Oh, yeah. We, you know, we had some great play from some our, our sophomores and, and our freshmen as well. Uh, Haley Phillips was passing nails. Um, we switched up our rotation a little bit, and uh, Lindsey Crone uh, didn't play as much as she normally does, uh, but it worked out well for us. So uh, we talked a little bit about uh, late, late today, uh, Mike Krzyzewski's fist and basketball. You know, when you have five fingers that are apart, they can be broken easily. Uh, when you put them together, uh, that's a, those, are, those fingers are almost impossible to break. So uh, just talked about coming together and playing as a team uh, and play for each other, and it worked. All right, for you as a team, you had mentioned earlier you're barely sneaking into the tournament. You make this run. Now you're going on to, to the NCAA tournament. What does it feel? What do you say now to the girls? Or do you say anything at all just knowing that the momentum and what they've done to carry through? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, we're in the exact same position that we were <laughs> a, a week ago. So we're probably going to be an eight seed because our, we're 16 and 18 on the year. We've got a sub-500 record, which means we'll, we'll play a one seed. Uh, and if we stay in region, the most likely we Calvin. So uh, they just beat Hope last night to, to prop possibly uh, regain number one in the nation. Uh, and so we're going to have our work cut out for us. But, hey, as always, we've got nothing to lose. Congratulations on a great tournament, great run. Thank you, Coach. Thank you.